And lastly, five words that can increase your profit. So the five words that can greatly increase your profit. Now, these are not magic words. There's nothing special about them, but you'll see how it can really change the price of your job. This all happened because of an experience that I went through. So let me tell you this story. A friend of mine called me at lunch and said, hey, I have a job for you. Um, I'm not even sure if this can be done, but I thought of you and I wanted to call you, see what you thought. So I was like, okay, well, what is it? So it's a, it's an office. It was an office remodel that um, it was like two layouts, basically just laying out some cubicles and they wanted it in 3D and a nice presentation for a meeting. So I was like, okay, that doesn't sound too bad. And he said, well, the thing is, is that he needs it today. And I was like, oh, okay, um, well, that's not much time. Uh, send it over to me. Let me take a look at it and let me see what I can do. So, so he sent it over to me. I looked at it and I was like, you know what? Yeah, I could do this. Um, I could probably get it done today. Um, I have the software. I have the time. So, um, yeah, I could do it. And he's like, he's like, oh man, he's like, that's great, that's great. He goes, so what? What do you? What, what's it gonna cost? So this is where the five words came in. And in my mind, I already had a number in mind. I actually was thinking, you know, this might take an hour, two hours of my time. I could do it for 150 and that might be fair, that might be okay. So before I said that number, I asked him, I said, well, what's it worth to him? Or what's it worth to you? So those are the five words. What's it worth to you? And um, I just waited. And he was like, well, I don't know, maybe $1,500. And I was like, okay, yeah, I could do it for $1,500. And he was like, oh, okay, well, let me, let me ask the client and I'll get back with you. He calls the client up, the client agrees. They call me back and say, you know, or my friend calls me back and says, hey, they agreed to it. You know, he needs it. He needs it today. Uh, if you can do it, it's done. So I was like, okay, absolutely. I'm on it. I'm, I'm going to do it. So I got to work in an hour and 15 minutes. I knocked it out, emailed it to him. And in a few days, a few days later, I got the check in the mail, $1,500. So it really those five words increase the profit of that one project 10 times. So again, now there's not magic. Again, they could have came back and said less, right? He could have said $100 or, or $50, right? So that's why it's important that you already know what your time is worth and what you will do work for. So if they would have came with something less, then I would have just said, well, you know, I really need to do, you know, 150 or $200 and and then you negotiate right but if you throw those words out at the right time you might just be surprised at what you hear so just a, a word of advice again it's not magic you know it's it could be a hair miss for you but it's just something to have in your arsenal of negotiation if you are about to discuss the price of a job with a client and neither one of you has said anything yet you may want to throw these five words in there before you say anything else Ask them, what's it worth to you? You may be surprised at the number they throw out. It may be much higher than what you were thinking, as in the case that happened with me. Now, if they come back with a number that is lower than what you were thinking, then you would just revert back to your operating cost and the profit margin that you want to make and make that your minimum. And here I've just listed a few things that will increase the potential value of a project, as well as a few that will decrease the potential value.